Okay, so due to some requests about how we're streaming our CCTV equipment to YouTube, we'll be looking at that today and explaining how we stream our CCTV equipment onto YouTube. So we'll be using our own Domar account. So first you want to go in channel and then go to live. So this will load up the YouTube studio. Here you can see our existing stream that you can view. Okay, and here is some important information that we will need later on, such as the streaming key and also the URL. Okay, so to stream on YouTube, we need to use a software called OBS. It's an open broadcast software. This isn't made or developed by ourselves. It's open source and you're free to contribute to their software. So here we've got our camera already set up, but we're gonna walk you through it. So here we've got the RTSP address for the stream. So the username is admin and password admin, but should you have changed the password, you will put in the new password in the second section. We got the app, which is directed to the IP address of the camera. You can find this using the search tool which you can download free off our website if you need it, but you can find the camera IP address there. After the colons, you've got 554, which is the port for the camera. And then after that is all the uh, properties and information for the camera, which you can simply copy uh, from this video and enter. Once you're happy with that, you wanna click OK. So now we need to use that information that we saw on the YouTube page earlier. So we need to open up the setting and go to stream. And here you will put the YouTube service to YouTube RTMP. Ensure that it's on the YouTube primary server. And there you will have our uh, stream key, which is provided from YouTube, which we've shown earlier, which you can find here. And you can simply copy that key and insert it into this section here. And then once you've done that, just ensure you click OK. Next will be the output. So depending on the quality of camera, you might want to adjust the video bit rate. Because this is 4K, we have increased our kilobytes per second for the bit rate. Okay, once you've done all that, click OK to ensure you save it. And then you want to select start streaming to start streaming the, the live footage feed for the camera. You can then come back to YouTube and preview your live feed. Now you can see your live feeds on the camera and that is it. Thank you for watching our video tutorial. Please do like and subscribe the video if you enjoyed it. But also hit the notification button on the little bell so you could be notified when our next setting video is released. Should you have some ideas for video content that you'd like to see, do drop it in our comment section or drop us a message and we'll consider to make this uh, for our next video content. Thank you.